Yeah, this is mama na mototo. Mimi the Kiswahili word also the mom and uh, with the child. child and carrying a basket oh. and firewood from the garden. That's the real African woman life. Exactly. That's okay. how we live. Hello, hello guys. Welcome to Glazio Adventures. It's your girl Glazio Janet. So guys, today I'm taking you to one of the art centers in Kasese town where they make art sculptures out of bronze like guys real bronze if you want any art piece like any animal uh shape like anything any shape they sometimes even uh customize they don't like even customize things like you can whatever you want you tell them what you want and they make uh, the art a uh, piece that you want out of bronze like real bronze guys so this is where we are going today so that you can be able to view and maybe you can even make your orders or oh, when you come to Kasese Uganda you know where you can get uh, the real art uh, pieces that are bronze Welcome to Renzori Founders. Hey, this building uh, it is made out of um, old uh, drums. Forty-five dollars is how much? Forty-five dollars. Hey. Forty-five dollars. How much? Forty-five dollars. Yes. I know, like it's what. Which one? What? Like this is real bronze. All the way, like Kasese, Kasese made guys. In Kasese, we are making bronze. You see, mm. invest your money in the right place. <laughs> uh -huh. Hey, this is probably Kasese. Guys, I'm not in America. I'm in Kasese. <laughs> we have bronze. <laughs> That is what? That is a lion, right? It's a baby lion. This one is a baby lion. It's a what? A female lion. An other. We have got couple. It's a female lion. I don't know. 
went to Greek. I've never got tired of the place actually. Then I go away in factory, we in factory. Then I go away. Now you the display thing. Stones like real stones. Hey. Stones. Ah. Pelbrim. You, you, you may you may you may think it you may think it's an ego, but it's a pelbrim. It shoots high in the sky. And when it sees the the, the, the chicken, then it comes and like, oh. takes over the head. Okay? It goes high in the sky. Okay. So the fight goes, the side it gains and it's here. Oh. Then it just comes and ah. gives it. Yeah. So for you, ah, you just take it, you just take it. <laughs> <laughs> it gets the target to your mouth. Ah. Now, here we've got different artists with different art designers. We have mods for these pieces. Okay? All those ones that we have outside here are called here mm. And those totems, we came into existence because of protection of wild animals. For example, if she's um, the clan totem is like that one which doesn't eat the, the hippo. For example, mine is like the hippo. That means if like she's in our family, that means I will not kill that animal. And she's not also going to eat our. Okay? In doing so, we shall be protecting the wild animals. Okay? Similar to where are killing them people who are like hunters to the practice their night so they can kill animals at any time. Okay? So when that came to existence, that kind of friendship, that kind of love, protection of animals came to existence. Okay? A lot of processes to which at this um you remember the stone age period all those things so people used to stay in the bush you can see there is a chimpanzee there is a uh, these people is this there's this sir uh, is this family okay they are busy doing the work but this is a uh, this is a uh, a banana plantation okay and this kind of banana plantation is in the forest there so this is a strong man who has managed to build this one. But some others just used to uh, stay under caves, under the uh, thick shrubs. <laughs> yeah. Then we've got our stones carved here. But all animals are from Africa. Or did you turn the right? From Africa. Yes, I would say from Africa. Yeah. Then there is a peddler. A man, a man carrying a matoke.